Okay, first violins. Let's look at the poco meno mosso in the last movement. Okay, so I think if we maybe start in third position, so one. Close your bow. So that you could just do one and then half step shift. You could stay here if you want. Okay, then you don't have the string crossings, or you could also go to third. You just have the extra string crossing. Regardless, I would do a one instead of crossing again, right? So I think it's easier to be in second position, okay? So, uh, third. One. So you're going to stay in second. This is first, uh, sorry, third position again. Three, two, float your bow. Now you could do, oh, sorry. So one, four, one, or if you wanted, you could do a little mini slide. One, two, three. Then you could do two, one, one. Two, four, three. Two, one, two, and shift there. Or you also do two, three, if you want to go earlier. Okay, so. Sorry. Then third position again. Loads. Last, the second time we go, then we would do more retard and do the fermata. The first time, don't do that. So, okay, the second time. We start, okay? All right. So, for the pizzicato, make sure we're all vibrating. And don't rush when we have a bunch of them in a row. Be nice to your concert master, yes, and your principal view. Make sure you're vibrating. Give them time there, right? Okay, all right. Oh, I forgot to do this on the second violin. So when we have hook, save your bow. So you can really crescendo then. Okay? All right. Happy practicing.